Hey there, I'm Raichu, and welcome back to my randomised Nuzlocke adventure. In today's episode, we travel through Elex Forest, arrive at Goldenrod, and try and take down Whitney. Now, Whitney might not have her mill tank, but she definitely has something in store, and it's definitely worth watching. Remember, if you like the video, please hit like, subscribe to the channel, and head on over to Twitch where you can catch this live. Thanks very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the episode. So, first and foremost, let's have a look and see what we've got. So, we've got Trunks, the Absolute God, Hero, the Starter, our Steel Type Persian, got Hippowdon, the Ghost Dark, Absolute Donny, got Staryu, Patty, Tootle, the Poison Type Torterra, and Goop, the Poison Type Titar. Um, so, if I remember correctly, we should still be, yeah, in Azalea Town. We've just taken on Gohan, and we're heading through Elix Forest, so let's get that underway now. What iconic music. Oh, oh, new encounter. We'll take a Noctowl. I like Noctowl. Way nice. There we go. A new team member, or at least a box fodder. Fighting ghost. That's quite cool. Uh, what do we call you? We just call you Bob. Yeah, we just call you Bob. The best bird name. Your boss is gonna be angry. Ah. Okay. Is that right? Oh. Oh, right, okay. Oh, I was, I was like, I can't remember it being that easy when I did it before. Many, many moons ago, of course, being a ancient human being. Aha! Got him. Ta-da! Genius. Yeah, that's right. Ooh. Here she is. Spinny girl. Helicopter. <laughs> uh, yeah, go on then. I don't actually know how. Uh, oh, two. You can't, don't take my Pokemon. Okay, good. Come back. I thought I'd lost you there. Uh, Route 34, that means new encounter. What we're getting? Oh, are you kidding? Does that count as species clause? I feel like that counts as species clause, right? I'm going to say that it does. That's right. You heard it here first, gang. I'm gonna stick Gar out. And we're gonna get something that doesn't evolve into a Torterra. Oh, really? I mean, Magby's cool. Magmar's cool. And maybe getting a Magmortar is possible, but you have to evolve it and. That's kind of painful. Surely a fast ball means works better on fast Pokemon. Don't know. I don't think a Magby's very quick, so fingers crossed. Nice. Get in. There we go. Um, because Magby and Magmar look kind of like ducks, I'm going to name it Cletus. I'll tell you why. Because when I was younger, I actually had a pet duck, and his name was Cletus. Now, I know that sounds odd, but I rescued a duckling out of a bin 
um, and raised it as my own in my garden and it just never wanted to leave until we took it to a farm and let it enjoy a pond with lots of other ducks. He was a great little pet. He used to follow me everywhere. He thought I was his mummy. And he only ever pooed on me when I let him go that one day. So, fun facts with Raichi. Snake backwards, my guy. Shout out, Randolph. One of my favourite Pokemon creators. I really like Pokemon cards. Big fan of pack openings. Big fan of Ace Graden as well. One day when I've got a bit of cash, I'll, uh, I'll be grading all of my Raichu cards. Probably with Ace, to be fair, because the labels and stuff look cool. Oh, Yanmega is so cool. One of my favourite Pokemon. I don't know if I actually put that in S tier in my tier list video, but I feel like I should have done if I didn't. I love how their names are just wrong, or, you know, not their actual names. I don't know why that's a thing in the randomizer, but I thought it would be amusing, and it certainly is. Speaking of Judgment and Arceus, very excited about the new game. Seen a little bit of it now, and it looks really, really cool. I think I'm probably going to get lost in it. I think I'm probably going to do a YouTube series and not stream it, because obviously recently I haven't been streaming very much and I'd kind of like to get this done and, you know, enjoy this live. So I'll probably just do a YouTube playthrough of Legends Arceus, which to be fair, I can probably smash out over the weekend and coming days after that. Oh god, I'm just going to say no. I'm really fed up. See, this is why. Who are you, Liz? Uh, and that's why you don't give your number out to strangers, kids. Right. Oh, there we go. Money. Give me all your money. You got booted out of the game corner. I mean, to be fair, I can take these guys on, get some money, and then go and check out that gambling place. Because I feel like you can get Pokemon from there, and I might just treat myself to one of those. Hopefully they're randomised as well, so, you know, I go to buy a certain Pokemon and get a completely random one. Cool. One and a half G, though. Yeah, let's go check out the game corner, see if you can just buy Pokemon here. I feel like you can. Du -du -du -du. Oh, what a jam. What's up, Mr. Game? Yeah, go on then. Thank you. Alright. Let's just try it then, I guess. So... Ooh. I love how this is just frying my brain. So I just got to flip, flip these things. That's not a good start. Are these connected? Oh, I can actually do that. So, yeah, okay. Oh, we're out here. So they're all gone. But did it actually cost me anything to enter that? I don't feel like it actually cost me anything to do that. Which seems weird. God damn it. How much... How many coins do you think I need for a Pokemon? Is that even a reward? Oh, come on! Okay, this is a perfect life lesson. Don't gamble. Oh my god. These ones are absolutely cucking me. What? Come on, man! Christ, was... I should probably just leave with some coins at some point and figure out what that does. Right, that's as many coins as I've... Yes, that's right. I would like to leave with three coins, please. 
Christ, well that was an ordeal, wasn't it? What are you saying, Mr. Man? You can exchange your coin surprises with the two gentlemen at the table over there. Right, okay, that's what I was interested in. So... Ah! See, now if they're random, all I've got to get is 200 coins. I've got to get to 200 coins just to get an abra out of this. <laughs> right, one more go. I'm winning big. No, I'm out. Screw you, Mr. Game Man person. I cannot be bothered with your stupid, stupid Voltor flip. Thanks, but no thanks. Let's crack on with our lives, shall we? Well, I'm just going to stop you there, because what you've just said is lies. I feel like this, Jim, you actually just have to battle everyone, don't you? Where can I get to? So... Maybe not. We'll see. Let's get it! The name Joey just reminds me of um, New Gear. I'm walking here. Aren't you just going to get in my way? Oh, I should have just spoken to the back of her head. Oh, now I've got to go and do a little loop. That's all right. Everyone's called Joey. What? All these lasses running around called Joey. So, shouldn't have a mill tank, which well, should make this easier, in theory, obviously. There's a chance she's got something incredible, but hopefully not. <laughs> Let's get it, Kate, Whitney. Whitney, Kate. Whitney, Kate, Ashley. What? I don't know. Sometimes I should just stop. <gasps> yeah, she's got a shoulder. I wish I had a shelter. I love shelter. I'm pretty sure it said she only had two. Oh, it's a ghost type. Okay. Slightly dangerous. Pagara, at least. Well, it's got a ghost type move. Never know their types. Think I was right, though. And you're gone. Big crit, well played. And a Latios. That's significantly better than a mill tank. What do I do here? Oof. That hurt. Oh, it's got rough skin. Okay. I think it might just be a dragon type, to be honest. Uh, where do we go from here? If it's a dragon type, I feel like I'm probably safe going to someone like that. But I'm going to go to Goop. Goop seems like a good switch. Get an Intimidate off in case it wants to use physical attacks. Heal up with Black Sludge. Pretty bulky anyway. It is just going for Dragon Pulse though. Jesus Christ, that hurts. I don't want to keep switching around, so hopefully I can sponge one. Yeah. Well played, me. God, it's bulky as well. Okay. Obviously switching out now. Uh, what has good special defense? Trunks, are you good on special? 46. Thirty-six. I think we just go trunks. 
take one. We should be taking one, regardless of that damage, I think. Now it speeds. Fair enough. Cool. This was significantly harder than I'd hoped. Eesh. Right, okay. So it still outspeeds me. Does she have healing items? Oh god, I don't know what to do. Is she gonna heal up? Yeah, okay, she is. Damn. But it gave me a free switch, so that's at least something. Oh, that still hurts. That was a crit. Oh, yeah, it's got rough skin. Need to remember that. I'm trying not to use items, because I feel like that's cheating. Although, I don't believe I specified that this was a particularly hardcore Nuzlocke. God damn. I think I'm going to have to use items. I think I'd fail otherwise. I mean, if I go into Patty, it just gets hit and then everything's pretty low. Although a hardcore Nuzlocke would be more fun. Ah, it's difficult, you know. I've used items in the past, though, so I feel like I should just continue doing that. See, but if I, I'm kind of stuck here because I can't take one. I've let myself get too weak now. This was a mistake. Damn it! Okay, I'm I'm pretty screwed here. Uh, I'm going to Patty. Oh, man. I think we're going to have to let Patty die. Ah, oh, my own incompetence has cost Patty its life, probably. How well was Gara taking them? Ah, oh, we're just going to have to do it. Goodbye, Patty. Oh, I really wish I sh I should have just sacked Hero. I know it's my start of it, it's just not as good. But, Patty, I think I was going to struggle to evolve, so. What do I do? Do I just go for a Hyper Beam? Or do I Signal Beam it? Signal Beam didn't do enough to kill, but Hyper Beam leaves me in a tricky spot. Because if it doesn't kill, I've got to stay in. I don't think I can take two. Or can I? I think I can take two. This might have been a mistake. God damn it, man. So close. Oh, no. That's not ideal, is it? Hmm. <clears throat> well, it... Uh, doing that doesn't even really help, does it? I've got nothing that's faster than it either, I don't. Oh, it's going to punch a hole in me. 
Well, definitely not letting Trunks go. Oh, I think next is... No, I'm stuck. I haven't got enough healing items to get through this situation. And I don't have anything that's fast. 37, 23, 42, 31, 30. Oh, I think I might just get swept. What do I do? What do I actually do here? If I stay in, Trunks dies. If I switch out, whatever I switch into dies. But then whatever I bring into revenge, I don't outspeed, so that dies also. I just keep dying until... Everything's dead, mate. <laughs> No. I've got nothing. <laughs> I'm so stuck. I'm pretty sure everything's just dead. If I switch... Right, so I'm in a position where the Latios outspeeds everything on my team. So if I switch out to save Trunks' life, something else dies. But then whatever I bring in after the next Pokemon dies... Also gets outsped by the Latios, so that also dies. Because nothing's got enough HP to take one hit, everything's dead. So because I didn't buy any potions, I've essentially failed. Unless, of course, it runs out of PP for... I think I'm just dead. Oh, man. Okay, I think the plan is go out into Hero, because at this point, I think Hero is the most expendable member of my team. See what happens. If I can get an opportunity to heal, I kind of want to heal up Tootle, because it's got a lot of health left, and see if I can't... I don't think I'm even knocking it out with Tootle. It's going to have to be Trunks, but... Oh god, I think I've just lost. I wish he had a mill tank now. Right, now what? <laughs> okay. Gar's got good typing, but a bad ability, and ultimately I'm not that fussed about it. So. I think I've got one potion. No, I've got two. Where do I even go with this, though? Do I go for trunks? I think I do. Right. I don't know if that would have killed without the crit, but it's happened. Ah, oh, right, now I've got a predicament, so I've actually got one potion left, so I could sacrifice either Goop or Tootle and definitely win, or I could hope that Trunks can take whatever move it wants to use and kill it and not lose another member of my team. What have I got in the box? I've got a Magby and a Noctowl. I think that might be it. I think that is it. Oh, man. I mean, let's look at this. So, 73... 38... Christ, we are pretty much just half health, aren't we? I think I can take one. Oh my god. Oh my god, thank god for that. Ooh. Jeez. 
Jesus Christ, that was hard. Okay. Lesson learnt. Buy healing items, use healing items. Don't switch around and let everything get decked and then decide you're gonna heal. Give me the badge. Yeah, I know. Well, she needs to stop doing that and give me the badge because she's just upset me and killed all my Pokemon. Oh my god, that was hard. Right, well, at least the run is still alive. Time to train up some... Shut up. Just get out of my sight, honestly. I'm an annoying, annoying person. To be fair, I think Zeus was alright. Um, so, let's move... Gara, I'm afraid you're gone. Hero and Patty. That's not good, is it? I've got six incredible Pokemon there. Well, I say that. Certainly Mum. I think Rocky could have been good. Gara, undoubtedly just really good minus its ability. Persian was meh, not so good, but Patty was pretty exciting well meet the gang we've got Borb the Noctowl fighting ghost and we've got a fighting type Magby and I guess we'll just have you in the party as well jeez oh that's so irritating hello Everyone's called Kate or Joey. I hate it here. Oh, really? Plus all. <laughs> well, maybe it's a grass type. I don't have one of those. That could be useful. But I don't kill it. Ah. Uh. Things are going wrong. Be good. Don't kill it. Weezing's good. Weezing's good. Statistically, Weezing is good. This is a good Pokemon. It's evolved. It's good. Don't kill it. I don't even need to kill it. You know what? It's going to yawn, and then I'm going to switch out. Oh my god, man. I just can't. Is it a flying type? That's going to get confusing. I think it is. Um, so I guess we're just... Mm, definitely don't want to waste an ultra ball, do I? I'll try great balls. No. Fine. Nice, okay, well that's better than uh, a Zeus. Oh, it's Ice Flying. That is an incredibly weird typing. I don't know what to think about that, but I'll take it. Um, ice Flying Weezing. Just, I might just call it Articuno. <laughs> Can I do that? Is that... I'm going to call him Arty. There you go. Because I'll know what that means, and it will make sure that I remember its typings. Well, if you made it this far, you've seen hell unfold on your screen. I, uh, I didn't play that particularly well, and may have cost myself largely there. I hope that you enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for another upload soon.